The Boeing 737 MAX 200 was meant to be a game-changer for the budget airline Ryanair. With increased seating, it was going to offer the low-cost market bigger profit margins. However, six years since its launch, the aircraft is not in our skies. Why? The Boeing 737 MAX 200 first came about in 2014. The aircraft was launched in September by the airframer as a modification to the 737 MAX 8. Rather than offering between 162 to 178 seats, the 737 MAX 200 was meant to have 200 seats. Able to carry more passengers, it seemed like the perfect solution to reducing operating costs per passenger. Ryanair was the launch customer for the jet, while Vietjet has also signed for this version. On September 8, 2014, Ryanair placed an order for 100 of the model, which was due to enter into service in April 2019. However, it has since been delayed. At present, Ryanair has a firm order of 135 MAX 200s and another 75 options. Though the aircraft can seat up to 200 passengers, Ryanair has opted for a slightly reduced capacity, instead offering 197 seats in a single class. However, that doesn't make the aircraft any less of a significant investment. The benefit of the MAX 200 is in its seat density. By placing more seats in the same amount of space, Ryanair and other budget airlines can reduce the cost per seat. Boeing says that this makes the MAX 200 20% more cost-effective than other 737 models. That, in turn, translates in other cost savings across the board. The MAX 200 offers a 5% reduced operating cost in comparison to the MAX 8, as well as 20% better fuel efficiency per seat. Essentially, the aircraft is a no-brainer for those working in the low-cost market. It's in this sector where the airframer really hopes to see demand increase. Boeing had predicted that the aircraft would make up 35% of single-aisle aircraft capacity in as little as 13 years. Having invested $11 billion in purchasing the aircraft, Ryanair clearly thinks so too. So, if the MAX 200 is so popular, why don't we see it in our skies? Sadly, the grounding of the 737 MAX put a stop to deliveries of the MAX 200. As a result of this, Ryanair had claimed that it wouldn't operate its first MAX 200 until April or May 2020. Speaking back in February 2020, CEO of Ryanair Michael O'Leary said, It's now likely that our first MAX aircraft will not deliver until September or October 2020. We're now running one year behind the original delivery schedule. We had hoped to have 55 aircraft in the fleet for the summer of 2020. We'll have none. For all its merits, it's unclear when the aircraft will be delivered to Ryanair, but one can only assume it'll coincide with the recertification of the 737 MAX. That said, recent developments are proving that high-density aircraft are not well suited to the market at the moment. Do you think the 737 MAX 200 will be comfortable enough to fly in? Let us know your thoughts in the comments. Did you know that we publish over 175 stories every single week on simpleflying.com? Be sure to check the link in the description for more great stories just like this. Thanks for watching, and be sure to like and subscribe before you go.